Well, hello everyone. I'm here to give a review of the HIPAA Carburetor Adjustment Toolkit. It was sent to me by HIPAA to do a review on and give them an honest opinion. And let me start off by saying the first thing I've noticed already out of this kit was this zips up. But this kit has a solid shell. A little soft, but it's hard. It's not, you know, bendable where it, like the other ones just come like in a bag. It's organized. And when you open it up, it has... I've already used it, that's why we're kind of moving around. Everything nets, and it's got every kind of tool you can probably imagine or need for the adjustments for carburetors. And it also comes with the cleaning spirals, um, the brushes for the carburetor stuff, which is a nice little add on. Um, usually, you know, you can, they're not that expensive, but just to have it in a kit, it's kind of nice. Um, I did adjust um, my edger carburetor on my Husqvarna uh, edger, stick edger, and um, I had the tool in here, no problem, worked fine. These are decent quality made tools. Um, not too heavy, but they're balanced well. Um, they got the descriptions on each side of each one. Um, decent seem like quality metal and stuff, and the plastic handles um, feel substantially okay there you know you're not using these to torque anything real hard so that they shouldn't give you a problem and i'm thinking with the hard shell casing um even if you put your toolbox in your truck and stuff out in the heat and you're in a lot of heat and stuff this is not going to you know cause these plastic handles to get weak and crack like some do you see over time a couple years they start cracking i think this was a smart move by them um i think they sell them on amazon but i think now they're moving everything to hippastore.com i'll put it down in the description um, I think they're having a sale through the third here, 6-3, um, 50% off, some stuff. You don't have to enter my name or anything like that. It's just, it's on their website. Um, I think they sell chainsaw blades and um, other tools, carburetor parts. Um, I've bought um, from them before some air filters for the Time Master, I believe it was. And they have little kits like that and stuff. So, and it's, re it's been reasonable. Um, Mm, and the, the, actually, the air filters I found were pretty substantially decent for the price um, compared to other ones, especially if you're working in dusty stuff and you don't keep them in that long anyway. Uh, but back to this kit, um, if you're looking for something, you're an independent, or even if you got field crews out in the field, this is a good kit to have because you can basically, especially if you're out there and you need to work on the spot, it's all organized, and it'll allow you to um, basically just pop out what you need and adjust the car. You know how many times we've been out there, blowers or weed eaters especially, trimmers, even chainsaws for that fact, if you don't use them for a while, sometimes they get a little bit off or whatever. You can adjust it. And then for some reason, if you really have to clean out a carburetor or some gunk, um, I don't usually do that in the field, but I mean, sometimes, especially with chainsaws, you, that little brush thing there will become, those brushes will come in handy. Um, but I mean, I think, I think this kit usually runs about 20 something bucks. I want to say, I may be wrong. It may be a little bit less, but Go check them out. Um, they got a neat little store. Um, good quality stuff. I probably will um, test it out on some other stuff. I, and I believe, I may be wrong, but I think this one here, oh, that may be the wrong one I was looking at earlier. One of these here I was looking at, um, let me see if I see, oh, maybe this one here is one of the star ones. This might be the ones that work on the 9010 blowers. My blower doesn't need it done yet, but I'll check it out, and if it does, I'll let you guys know. I'll follow up with a review. But it's a it's a nice little set. Um, oh, yeah, and they have another little... I mean, I don't have them set in there, but there's a band behind here, I believe, that you can slide these all in the band, so if you want to actually get them secured even better, you can. Um, but, I mean, we all like stuff that makes our life easy, and um, I think this kit is quality. And um, you know me, I don't give reviews to just to do it and like I said I'm not um, trying to push a product or anything but I just know we all can use stuff that makes our life a little easier and I mean very rarely do you see kits complete like this um, if they do they're kind of sometimes a little bit overpriced in my opinion uh, but for the price for this one what they're offering the quality and the, the shell alone I think is good I know I've been hacking on it and it zips up and I'm sorry about the shaky camera here I'm doing this on my phone and with my hand and uh, it's been a long couple of weeks here for me. Anyway, um, 
Not much else I can say right now about it. I will follow up though if I um, end up needing to adjust a carburetor on one of the blowers, the Hitachi or one of them. I'll, I'll probably make a short video just showing how simple these work. I mean, anybody can use these. Just uh, And if you've never done set screws on carburetors or anything, go on YouTube and um, just type in whatever kind of thing you're adjusting, carburetor and that. You'll see plenty of ones that tell you how to slowly adjust them, reset them, and stuff like that. It's not that difficult. You guys can do this stuff. It's not hard. Don't go put your stuff in a shop. It's nothing against shops, but you know, there's no reason to let your you know blower sit in a shop for three weeks just to get a carburetor adjusted. That's silly. Um, and pay 50 bucks or whatever, 85 bucks, whatever they're charging nowadays. You guys can do this and have be, be tooled up. Tool up your own equipment. Just like you buy good equipment, buy good tools to have on your truck and your vehicle with you because it, you can never have enough tools. That's kind of my key. And, um, and when you find a good quality price tool for a fair price, um, grab it, you know. Even if they're not made where you want them to be made at or um, they're not the brand you like usually or whatever, but if you think it'll do the job and get it done and it's, it's a really good price, um, it's a sale or something, grab them because, I mean, you'll be happy you have it when the time comes and you need it. All righty, until next time, um, have a good one. And like I said, I'll put some stuff down in the description, hopefully, and then get all the information you guys need to if you want to go take a look at these or buy one yourself. Have a good one. Thank you.